One of my favorite formatting commands in Excel is the Wrap Text command. You will find the Wrap Text command up here on the Home tab of your ribbon in the Alignment group right here, the Wrap Text command. And what the Wrap Text command does is it will actually wrap a long descriptive text for a column header or a row header within the cell that it resides. Notice that down here I have monthly total of sales, but it doesn't fit within the column width that I have designated for this column. I can easily cause Excel to wrap the text within this cell by clicking the wrap text command. And I'll go ahead and do that. And notice that now the monthly total of sales now fits very nicely within this column header. Let's go ahead and apply this to our product list spreadsheet. So please make the product list spreadsheet the active spreadsheet or open it up. And if you'd like to start with a fresh file that reflects the development of the course up to this point, you can open up 0709 start file. Then go ahead and select the product list tab so that we're on the product list worksheet. And what we're going to do is add a more descriptive heading for column B or the price per unit. So let's come up here to our formula bar and highlight the forward slash and the dollar sign and then type in price per unit and enter the data. Notice that it doesn't display price per unit within the cells with. We need to apply the wrap text feature. So let's come up here to our home tab of our ribbon in the alignment group wrap text command. And notice that now price per unit fits all within the cell. We might want to pull this out to get price per unit and then maybe center so we have a little more balance. And then if you come over here to your row and click and drag, you can pull that up and resize it so that price per unit fits a little nicer within our column headings. Go ahead and save your worksheet and more about formatting in the next movie.